Welcome, football fans, to this matchup in the Axis Football League. My name is Dave Stevens, along with my partner, Mike Steele. Dave, we see both teams right now getting those cleats laced a bit tighter. Checking that helmet one last time. Makes me want to run back down for one more go at it. This one's going to be great. Yes, sir. This isn't the first time we've seen this rodeo, Mike. Well, let's play some football. The quarterback, back to pass, and he goes down. That'll be a loss of 11. Drops back into the pocket. He tosses one. That brings up third down. Quarterback to pass, throws a pass, and he can't reel it in. The offense lines up to punt this one away. Number eight on the punt. Number 30 catches the punt. The away team begins the drive from the 40-yard line. Number 10, looking to pass, fakes the handoff and looks to pass. And it's off. The quarterback steps back into the pocket. Incomplete. Third down. A penalty marker on the play. The home team accepts the penalty. A lot of false starts are caused by players getting preoccupied with what they're going to do on the play and forgetting the snap count. Number 10 steps back into the pocket and he misses his mark. When it's third and long, sometimes you've got to throw it downfield even when you know that's exactly what the defense is expecting. It just didn't work out for them at that time. The kick is caught at the 21. The home team will start from the 28. Number 17, pitching it out. He drops back to pass. Grabbed out of the air. He's brought down. And that's enough for a first down. Pitching it off to number 24. That brings up second down. Number 17 dropping back. And he's forced out. Third down. Number 47 takes the ball. That'll be enough for the first down. Fakes the handoff. And he misses his mark. He takes the ball. This line today, regardless of who is in the backfield, they're making it a point to create those running lanes. Throws, makes the catch. Good enough for a first down. Tosses a pass, out past the first down marker. That brings up second down. Number 17 gives it away. Third down. Go. 
The pitch is taken by number 24. That will bring up first down. Brought down almost immediately. That gets us to second down. That gets us to third down. That marks the end of the first quarter. Both teams still sitting at zero. Number 17, back to pass, and he can't reel it in. As a coach, you hope your players have the ability to get past the mistakes they've made and execute the next time they're in that situation. You can't blame the quarterback for taking a shot there. They weren't in a great situation on third down and needed to chuck it downfield to try and pick up the first. The kick is caught at the nine. The away team has a great opportunity to get back out in front of this ball game on this drive. Go. He pitches the ball to the runner. That gets us to second down. quickly back near the 25 yard line third down steps into the pocket the pass falls harmlessly to the ground out comes the punt team the punts away number 30 takes the punt the home team comes into this drive with a one possession lead I'm looking for them to try and take a chunk of time off the clock and grab another score. He steps back to pass. And he safely steps out up at the 48-yard line. That will bring up second down. He hands it to number 47. That will bring up first down. It's runs like that, Dave, that helps set the tone for this game. Nothing fancy, just our guys beat your guys. Second down. Third down. Throws one, and it's off. The QB took a deep shot there for the first down, but the defense had it covered the whole way. Hike. The punt's away. The punt will sail out of bounds. It's a one-score game, Dave. You have to feel good about your chances here if you're the offense. Let's see how they execute. Steps into the pocket. Heaves a pass. The tackle is made by Wilson. Lining up with two tight ends. Number three on the carry. He tosses it to number three. Let's see what the call is on third down. He tosses one deep down the left side. That'll be enough for the first down. He takes the ball. <laughs> Dropping back. It's caught for a touchdown. That's a play they won't mind seeing over and over in film this week. It's up. Oh, and he's, he's not going to have enough leg. The away team will take the lead with that score. Six, three. The away team slides into the driver's seat with the go-ahead score. The return man takes the kickoff. This is a pressure drive for the offense. 
They've got a chance to pull back into the driver's seat with a score on this possession. Throws a pass to the middle of the field. Second and short. Number 17, looking to pass. That will move the chains. Let's see what they do on first down. He drops back to pass, and he misses his mark. Throws one up the middle. The home team will call their first time out here, and that's enough for a first down. A dangerous throw there by the quarterback, but he's able to squeeze it in there. Second down. <gasps> Dropping back. Throws near the middle of the field. And it's off. He sets up and throws. Incomplete pass. Even though that pass was incomplete, those are the types of throws that stretch a defense. The D was up to the challenge that time. And it barely squeezes in there. That's good from 47 yards out. Number 18 kicks it off. Fielded at the 7. Makes the return up to the 22-yard line. The offense will begin the drive from the 23 Dropping back, he makes the throw. That brings up second down, second and short. He makes the throw over to the left side. The away team uses their first timeout. That will move the chains. Sets his feet and throws. The away team will call timeout. Second down. The safety came over late to talk with the DB. Breakdowns and coverage like that just can't keep happening. Number 82 pulls it in. That'll bring up a fresh set of downs. And that brings us to the end of the second quarter. An even matchup so far. Six, six. Number 18 kicks it away. Number 80 catches the kickoff. And he's brought down after a return of 13. Let's head down to Emma Adams on the field. Emma, what can you tell us? Gentlemen, I had a chance to discuss the first half with the coach for the home team. The run defense was virtually non-existent in the first half, and he said the game plan going into this week was to limit the amount of yards given up through the air. The ball is not loose. Stop. Great play by the defender. We've seen the ball carrier getting a bit careless, and they finally got the ball out of there. The offense has a chance to pick up some free points here after that turnover. Second down. Go! And he's off. Third down. Miss tackle on the defense. That brings up fourth down. The offense was expecting heavy pass coverage over the top and wisely ran the ball to pick up a few yards. The kick is off. Number 80 catches the kickoff. And he's brought down after a return of 20. If the offense can drive down the field and get some points here, I'd expect to see a big momentum shift in the game. He makes the throw, and he can't reel it in. He steps back to pass. Number 80 with the catch. That will move the chains. Let me tell you, Dave, 
Hearing those chains move is one of the best sounds to the offense. He hands it to the runner, and he stopped. That brings up second down. He hands it to number 26. Third down. Number 10 gives it away. That'll bring up a fresh set of downs. You see those big linemen starting to put hands on the hips, getting a bit tired of staying on the field. Number 10 gives it away. That gets us to second down. Number 3 on the carry. That brings up a crucial third down. Airs one out. And he scores! That's one way to rack up fantasy points. You get a lot of passing yards, receiving yards, and a touchdown all in the same play. It's good! The away team takes the lead. 13-9. That was a big possession for the offense for them to be able to take the lead like that. Number 10 takes the kick, makes the return up to the 18-yard line. If the offense can drive down the field and get some points here, I'd expect to see a big momentum shift in the game. Marshall takes the ball. Tackled near the line. That will bring up second down. Handing it off to number 33. Excellent footwork on that run to pick up the first down. Second down. Tonight. Number 33 on the carry. That gets us to third down. Tonight. Sets his feet and throws deep down the field. The pass falls harmlessly to the ground. Tonight. He punts it away. Number 30 takes the punt, and he's brought down after a return of eight. The away team has the chance to make this a two-score game with this possession. Steps into the pocket, tosses a pass, and he can't reel it in. Go. That brings up third down. That signals the end of the third quarter. The away team with the lead so far, 13-9. Number three takes the ball. A conservative run call on third and long. You don't want to unnecessarily take any risks there and end up in a situation that's difficult to recover from. Number 30 takes the kick. It's a one-score game, Dave. You have to feel good about your chances here if you're the offense. Let's see how they execute. Number 17, looking to pass. And he's tackled. That will bring up second down. The runner dodges away. That will move the chains. This line today, regardless of who is in the backfield, they're making it a point to create those running lanes. Makes the throw, and he's tackled. Number 17 makes the handoff. A flag on the play. We'll see if the penalty affects the outcome. The home team will accept the penalty. So many penalties are just mental mistakes. Number 17 makes the handoff. Second down and goal. Tonight. He 
score. I love to see that kind of confidence in your offensive line. Hand it off and let him lead the way good. into the end zone. It's good. The home team takes the lead. 16, 13. We may be seeing a big momentum shift here, Dave. Taking the lead like that does a lot for a team's confidence. The return man catches the kickoff. And he's brought down after a return of 15. This is a pressure drive for the offense. They've got a chance to pull back into the driver's seat with a score on this possession. He pitches the ball to the runner. Second down and short. Makes the reception. That will bring up first down. Drops back into the pocket. The running back pulls it in. And that's enough for a first down. When you can keep the sticks moving quickly like that, it's a good way to build momentum on a drive. And he misses his mark. Back when I was playing, if a receiver dropped a pass, he'd run a mile. If we see him running up and down the sideline, we'll know why. Number 96 brings him down in the backfield. Loss of 10. That will bring up third down. Third down and long. Quarterback to pass. Complete to number 80. Number 10 lining up under center. Dropping back. Caught. Brought down by number four. Failed fourth down conversions can often be the turning point in a game. The offense couldn't get it done, and now the other team will take over on downs. Go! The away team will call timeout. Steps into the pocket, tosses a pass, and he misses his mark. He steps back to pass. He can't make the catch. Out comes the punt team. Number eight punts it away. And the punt goes into the end zone for a touchback. It's a one-score game, Dave. You have to feel good about your chances here if you're the offense. Let's see how they execute. Airs one out deep downfield to the sideline. Let's see what they do on first down. The ball falls to the ground, incomplete. The away team lining up with three receivers. The quarterback looking to pass. He tucks it and runs. The home team will call their first time out here. Good enough for a first down. Receiver gets up with a big first down motion. Pretty sure the defense have seen enough of that already. The home team will use one of their timeouts here. That'll be enough for the first down. He sets up and throws. He can't make the catch. Incomplete. Hike. Throws one to the right side of the end zone. And they can't connect. Incomplete. Hike. Here's the kick. And it's good. <laughs> but I'll tell you, not by much. <laughs> Number 18 kicks it. Number 10 takes the kickoff. Tackled after a return of 17. He hands it off. The home team uses their last time out. Second down. Play action fake. Foster makes the catch. First down. Go. 
The quarterback, back to pass, incomplete pass. With the gloves these guys have today, drops should be a thing of the past. Go! Marshall takes the ball. The away team is lining up for the kickoff. Number 18 boots it. Number 10 takes the kick. And he's brought down after a return of 29. He drops back. The offense will fake the handoff and look to pass. The ball falls to the ground. Incomplete. Go. He hurls one deep along the sideline. And they can't connect. Incomplete. Finds a target past the first down. That'll bring up fourth down. The punter punts it away. Fielded at the 13-yard line. Go. He hands it off. Second down. Second down and short. Hike. And he won't make it very far before being dragged down. Third down. That'll be enough for the first down. Excellent footwork on that run to pick up the first down. Second down. Pitching it off to number three. That will bring up third down. Steps into the pocket. The pass connects with number 19. That'll be enough for the first down. That's pure focus out of the receiver there. He knows the defense is bearing down, but kept his eyes on the ball and protected it after the catch, too. Go! The QB hands it off. The home team calls the first timeout. That brings up a crucial third down. Hike. He makes the handoff. The home team takes a timeout here. That brings up fourth down. A conservative run call on third and long. You don't want to unnecessarily take any risks there and end up in a situation that's difficult to recover from. He steps back to pass. Sends a pass. Number 16 makes the completion. The away team takes their first time up. Good enough for a first down. That play really caught the defense off guard. I'm not sure what they were expecting there on first down, but it wasn't that. Finally brought down. The away team takes their third time out. Marshall takes the carry. The away team will take their third and final time out here, and that's enough for a first down. If they keep doing this, the kicker's going to have a much easier job today. Extra points only, perhaps. He hands it to the runner, tackled quickly. Third down, third and goal. Go. 
Number 30, he scored! A lot of great performances today, Mike. Who do you have as the stud of the game? Today, I'm picking Marshall for the home team. The other team couldn't handle him today.